What is up everyone over here some more DDSS today we're over here playing some perk as always and we're about to hit tier 4 So the long awaited tier 4 which has the rocket symbol as the icons That means we're going to be hopefully going to other planets and hopefully diving into galactic core finally uh, Don't know what it's going to take to obviously make that stuff or make the rockets But we should be able to hopefully soon be able to visit other planets Um I want to start with the. I want to start with Mars. Uh, I don't know if we can start by going directly to Mars. I think we need to go to Moon first, and then we go to the Moon, get some ores to go make the plates for Mars travel, um, because Mars has the vibranium that we need. So for the alloys and smelter quest. But as you can see, kind of do a little off-camera work. Um, we have a mana pool set up now, a fully functional, self-sufficient uh, tree farm that I built last night, which is already filled up on logs and uh saplings um it's halfway to apples and it's got a whole bunch of red coal this is based on i think dire wolf's uh setup that he did so and then we have this going over here and making mana for us so we got three munch and do munch juice in there uh eating leaves away and sending mana to these uh mana spreaders and whatnot so we're gonna join back to discord see what's up and yeah we're gonna enjoy the time okay perk what's up i just leave again the server is lagging for me Oh, oof. Sucks. Yeah. Like, as soon as you logged in, I saw your body and I saw your stream. I was like, he's not here, but he's here. Okay, like so first thing. I don't know why. First, first thing we're going to do is we're going to build this advanced. I dropped you your smelter. terrace still in your house. I don't know if it's there, but it still should be. Or up at the top floor where you were last time. Okay. Uh, I'm not, not seeing any tears still, still here. Yeah, I'm not seeing any tears still, still here. Yeah, it might be still in inventory then. Uh, anyway, we're gonna start this this one off with a good old alloy smelter. This thing has been <laughs> hinting at the whole time in the quest book. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and build <laughs> this advanced alloy smelter from tier three. I got all the Ugh, parts I need that, for that it. Hurt. Um, Basically, all the parts I need for I think that's basically done. So we're gonna go ahead and build this, and this is supposed to triple our output on ores um, compared to the smelter, which doubles. Uh, so we're gonna see. Um, this is a three by four structure. Uh, it starts by making this blueprint to see what you need, and then you can go down here and see all the different items you need. But luckily, the quest book actually has a quest up to see to make everything you need for it. Uh, so by the time you're done, then you're done. Um, so we can go yeah up. i tuned in your stream while ago and i forgot i had it unmuted so all i heard was what's going on guys and i'm just like ow <laughs> um let's see how do we do this like it low key it out of me i was like damn i was like damn do the indefinite stuff and i realized that you actually started your stream i was like oh, well it's like okay, a 30 so... second delay Hmm. What is, is this the bottom layer? We have a firebox casing. Is that the bottom layer? So the Prudentium furnace is the bottom layer. So that's this layer. Okay. And that's the top layer. Okay, cool. So now we know how this works and how it looks. Um, so we can go through and block by block and see what's up. So it looks like we have firebox casing, uh, fluid hatch, machine casing. Okay, so let's start with these first three. Uh, input hatch, this is a fluid input hatch. This is a, a firebox casing, and then we have reinforced machine casing. So where do we want to build this? In gold chest in the very middle. Uh, cool. Cool. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, so. Um, where do we want to build this? You know, our, our advanced alloy smelter. Um, it's a four by three block. I guess we could build it right here at the end of all this, but then if that's the case, we have to build a wire over here that's a little bit longer. So I guess let's build it right here um, behind this improved blast furnace. Um, and we'll build it right here behind all this stuff here, and we'll put it right here. So. I'm gonna have to restart my pack. Gotcha. Um, 
So we're gonna put it sideways, we'll put it long ways. I guess we can just put it long ways behind this Coke oven here. We'll put it like two blocks off, or three blocks off, we'll put three blocks off, okay. So first let's start with, Oh, okay. Can we do this? Oh, there we go. Uh, right click to place preview, move away. Turn this though. Why is it just turn that? I want to turn it. Maybe you have to place it to the side. Oh. Huh. I don't know. This doesn't want to turn the preview. Actually annoying. Huh. I don't know why it's just, that's kind of weird. I can't, I mean, I want to, I want to just look at the box to place it. But this is annoying as in like I can't turn it. Well, I guess I'm just not gonna do that then. Okay, so we're gonna do which which layer is this controller? Okay, so the controller's on the side actually. So that's good, that's fine. Um So I guess we'll just put the controller facing that way, I guess. Or we'll put it facing this way. Um so we get rid of this. Get rid of that. Okay. It's annoying, but it is what it is. Okay, cool. So controllers we put on this side. Or no, this side. I lied. Damn, you have more HP than I do. So we have input hatch, or fluid input hatch, firebox casing, reinforced machine casing. Okay, so uh, we're gonna need those uh, fluid input hatch, Imagine firebox like casing. Yeah, I know, right? Input, fluid input hatch, firebox, reinforced machine casing. So. Um, fluid input hatch. It's a firebox. Firebox reinforced. Okay. Firebox reinforced. Okay. And then I will work. I will see if I can work on input the output hatch. Gate, the outline gateway. Yep. Energy input. I'll find fucking yes, smelter. Um, firebox. Uh, uh, Sao. Yeah. Because uh, there's a there is a uh, a world called Alpha. I know. Fluid input. So both these are fluid inputs. So two away. Done. Okay. Two reinforced here and our firebox there. Reinforced there. Energy there. I already missed Peanut, but I'll see her again. Um, furnace smelter. Furnace uh, smelter. Okay. Next level. 
Reinforced, reinforced, reinforced. Item output, item input. Heat exchanger fangs down the middle. I think that's what that was. Yeah. Output, input. Input. I swear that said input. I even saw that it was red, but I could have swore that said input. Input or output input. A controller. Boop. Okay. And then. Okay. Um. Now I'm back. Reinforce, Sorry. Reinforce. I just need to... Can you Firebox. go to the Alpine Quest and tell me how it's spelled? Uh. A. Uh, why? A L A L F H E I M. I'm just gonna stop the stream and read a minute. Bam, 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 bam. These firebox casings are one, two, three. Gearbox right there, and where you crystal there. And then gearbox, and then a powered Nori crystal. Bam. Uh, blueprint there. Blueprint found. Structure found. Not enough energy. Okay, cool. I need to bring in energy. Um, we'll bring it off on, from the other side of the battery, so I'm going to have to do a longer cable going this way, I guess. Um, and the energy is this block here, so. Um, th oh, no. That's three. It's four, five, six, seven. Okay. So. Oh, my shovel's broken. Ripperoni. Let's get some bronze to repair my shovel. Bronze. I still haven't changed my shovel or axe heads yet. Okay, so power is going to come off this side. Um, go down one more. Okay, this is the solar panel array here. Well, what we're gonna do, go down underneath it. And go over one block. There's where we're gonna take off of it. So, or from that side, and just go straight down. One of those. Either way, it's gonna use, I guess, if they do that front side, it's gonna take out one more, I guess. Um, yeah. Yeah. 
Okay. Something like that. Something like that. Yeah, we'll put it on a block there. Boop. Yeah, something like that. Put a torch in here so things don't spawn. Boop. Okay, so we need some more uh, advanced universal cables. Memories are pain to make somewhat. Um, yeah, we need silicone. Do we find these? I don't think we can make aluminite yet. Oh, no, we can. Okay, so yeah, I'm thinking of something else. I'm thinking of adamantium. Uh, yeah, aluminite is just aluminum, iron, and obsidian. <sighs> so we can make those plates. Uh, we need silicone, which we have plenty of silicone. Basic universal cables are just yeah, steel plates, the red alloying, and more silicone. Um, Honestly, we might be able to do just basics and run it over here. Honestly, until we get some other, some other uh, stuff. Once we have some advanced that are just chilling in the electronics chest that we don't have running right now. We have 44 basics, so let's just run a basic. Uh, so that way we don't have to make advanced. I mean, we could make advanced, I guess. Might as well make advanced. That thing's going to be a power hungry hog, I think. Um, so let's just make some alum alumite plates, make some advanced cables. There you go, some alumite right there. And we need silicone. Creosote, silicone, so there we go. Where is the compactor, compactor area? Boop, make me plates. So if I can make three recipes, right? That means I can get, I need 12, which I have nine, so it could be 12. And this is in the, oh, whoops. This is in which one in the engineers? Yeah, engineers. There you go, 12. Okay, cool. I actually like that. That's nice. What? Um, is I, I um sometimes I want to actually have my Discord and all of my other shit on one monitor. So what I did was I took all the active feed, all the chats, the media requests. I put it on my secondary monitor, and I put the actual overlay that I have that shows my screen onto my um my compute my my computer case. So I can see everything that I need to see on my computer case, and then for chat and the follows and the active feed, all that I see it on my main monitor. So hmm. I can still watch your stream and see all this shit at the same time. So, oh, nice. I think what I'm planning on doing is I'll get my other monitor in here. I'm gonna get two. I'm gonna change my monitors to two vertical monitors. Yeah. I don't. I don't get enough chatting Razor, for our monitors. Cutters. Up, so. Uh, no. I mean, uh, just for Discord purposes and stuff like that yeah I, I mean i guess but i have no reason to i i've tried before <laughs> you you want a flat screen uh monitor for that it doesn't really fit good with curves i do a flat so the two monitors on the side will be flat the main monitor is the yeah. one that's gonna be curved i i want to get a i want to get one big monitor 
So it'll be the sides of both of my monitors combined for my main monitor, and then I just want to get two separate ones for the top. Like you, you've seen those big ass fucking sixty yeah. inch. I'm I'm curious to how this thirty two inches is gonna look compared to my twenty seven inches. That extra five inches. Uh, I think mine are thirty. Yeah. Will this cable make it all the way? I don't think it will. No, it didn't. I need one, two, three, four, five, six. One more recipe, basically. I need one more recipe. Um, so that means I need some more Illuminate. I need one more Illuminate ingot. One more. I don't have it, essentially. That's weird. I thought mine were 32 inches. I have a Lumi block. Yes. How big are they? Uh, mine are 22. Mine are about 25, 24. <gasps> oh, um. yeah. I thought mine were bigger than that. <laughs> wow, your series are smaller than mine. I have two 27 inches right now. Yeah, but so like big. mine doesn't, mine don't look small, but me. Yeah, well, I, I when I first started, I was on this, which I still have it back at home. This nineteen point five inch monitor, that's what oh I played on. God. Like that was my first, and then, so I'm back home. I have a triple monitor set. I have the two my two twenty seven inches and then my nineteen point five inch right there. Well, now I'm gonna have my two twenty seven inches and my thirty two inch. Is my setup triple monitor? Oh my god! So. Dude, I'm comparing that to my monitor, and I could not. I could yeah. not do nineteen inches, dude. I would yeah. fucking <laughs> my fucking eyes. That's what I, that's what I've started on, dude. That was my beginner laptop, or my beginner monitor, man. Oh my god! Like nineteen inches is fine for a laptop, but for like an actual computer, dude, that's just. Whew. Yep, I think I had it close. <laughs> And I got my first 27 inch and my ooh, and then like a year later I got another 27 inch, same 27 inch. I'm either now that I figured out that mine are 25 inches, I might go with a 32 for the for my main gaming monitor, and then use the other 25 inch for like uh, chat and shit. Yeah. Like if my, if um if I had my TV on the wall where my um above my computer, which will not and will never fit there, then I could always just use that for chat. Yeah. It is um that is a uh, there we go. It's a fifty five inch TV and that shit is not fitting on that fucking wall. Yeah. Nope. Yo, Good 15 ad. viewers, Toby, Poggers. Yep, I got a lot of people at work. Missing fluid input. So what kind of fluid input do you do with these? Is it water? Uh, advanced alloy. Like, what do you... Oh, here we go. Lava. Lava or boosting mixture? Yeah, it's lava. Lava and boosting mixture. That's the two different things that this thing uses. Hmm. Okay, what does this Mirian do? Because I see this as there's a sword. Yeah, that's that's fucking weird, bro. There's Imagine a sword, sword here. Now. To me. Occasionally, a gold or diamond ore will appear in stone immediately surrounding you at the cost of durability. Oh wow. Mana can be used in place of durability and can heal the tool over time. Okay, that's pretty neat. Huh. So if you use star metal, right? 
as a like the the main piece. It says the effects depend on the player's attunement. Huh. I only imagine. Okay, well we have the machine. So now we need a source of lava. Um, we have the lava fabricator, but that costs a good bit of lava, a good bit of power to use that. That's the only problem. Lava fabricator. Yeah, if I remember correctly, a large amount of power. Yeah, large amount of power. So. I feel like that's just gonna eat away at our power if we put that there. Possibly. Um. Hmm. Quandary. I guess I can just put tanks. I could just put tanks there. And. Yeah. Just fill it manually with lava when I want to use it. Yeah, that's what I'll do. I'll put two wooden tanks there. And put fluid hatches to it. Because, I mean, that's the easiest way to put boosting mixture and stuff like that in there, too. Um, we have two more carpenters now, by the way. Uh, I think one of the quests gave me two carpenters, so we'll actually have, like, four and then six. <laughs> Of six carpenters. Uh, where's the servos? Mm. Just basic servos should be fine. No reason to make those into better servos. I'm back. I'm back. Why is that game picked up? What? That should. Picked up by this. Is it only hold a maximum of eleven? No, this is just a different one. Huh. Well, that's weird. There's some different ones to find out huh that's interesting very very interesting Maybe two wooden tanks that's all we need just four thousand mil buckets we don't need anything even higher than that because it's just gonna go into the internal the internal system at that point so there pop some lava in there um get berg what's up i need some lava from your lava sigil uh give me a half sec Actually, wait, no, I got 10 lava cells. Never mind, scratch that. Is the pure daisy on the ground somewhere? Yeah, it's over there. Okay. It is over there. Okay, so is it this one? Is that going to give me the lava that I need? 
Missing item input. Item input. Where is over there at specifically? Where it was before. Oh, wait, no, it's not. I got picked up, I guess. Um, it was I right here. Up, dude, because the server is lagging. I don't know, dude. It's your internet, dude. Literally, I'm having no problems. And don't be uninstalling your pack again or reinstalling it, because obviously that didn't do anything. So you have to take a look at your internet and see what's going on. Um, I think I got a pure daisy. Um, fine. Check the. Uh, you just you just bugged out on Discord for a second there, so it's definitely your internet. There's pure daisies, right? Yeah, there's pure daisy right here. The pure daisy is on the ground. There you go. Right here. Right here. You could have just, just plant it for me. I did, plant, I, did, I, I did plant it. It's literally planted right here on the ground. Past the runic altar towards your gem cutter thing. Stop right. Stop. Stop. It's right. Literally right here. Do you not see me? No, I don't. Okay. See, you're moving fine. So obviously it's either the download is messed up or your upload is messed up. One of those is f wonky because you're moving around fine on my screen. That means you're work. You're it's working. But for whatever reason, it's like your side of things. You can't see it for some reason. I don't know what's causing that, but one part of your either your download or your upload is wonky, and you're not seeing what the what you're supposed to be seeing, even though you're doing things, which makes it sound like it's download. Because upload means you 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 pass a, a move command and it's moving, so it makes me think that your download's all wonky for some reason. Like, is someone watching something or downloading something in your house right now? I'm home alone. I don't know what to tell you. Something with your download speed's wonky. I downloaded like 30 megs. I don't know. Something with your download speed's wonky. Either there's a bunch of jitter or something. I don't know. And my upload's around 17. Yeah, I don't know what to tell you. Like it works fine until I open a chest, so then it goes all a wire. Common reasons for lag. It says um, connection lag. Three types of connect. This is Bisex hosting this thing, right? Uh, server side lag, connection lag. Client side lag. Common reasons for lag. You have too many mods or plugins. Your server is running out of RAM. You are too far away from your server. You are using an outdated version of Minecraft. You have too many entities, items in your world. Um, I realized that someone earlier said you should be running this pack at like six gigs of RAM. Mm -hmm. You have like four. So that might be help. Might might be a problem. Latency or otherwise known as ping is the time it takes practice from the computer to reach the server. If you're located too far away from the server's location, you will have a high latency and packets from your computer will take longer to reach the server. For example, if you place a block on the server, it may take a second to actually place the block on the server, or if you hit a player, it may take a second to register damage. This is because your Minecraft client has sent every action to the server and the server has to verify these actions and send it back to your client. Like, my, my ping is fine. Here, here. Go, go to... Go to um, open up command prompt, right? Uh, 
that is Cortana. Um, okay. Um, you're gonna do the command ping dash n or ping space dash n space five, and then I'm copying the server IP to you right now, and you're going to paste that in the thing, or just type okay. it in there, and tell me what your ping is. Ping request could not find host. Uh, do it without the um the the last the semicolon thing. Without the oh okay, the semicolon number. So without the two two five yes. five eight zero? yes okay reply reply minimum ninety two maximum one hundred and eight one hundred and one average is one hundred and hundred milliseconds not bad since your latency to the server is higher than two hundred milliseconds it means you're located too far away from the server. There's no way to fix high latency because it's based on your physical location. However, we offer servers in multiple locations so players can get the best latency possible. Uh, for budget servers, we only have Canada and France. <laughs> Premium I servers, you have Dallas, Texas is the closest one. Which I, I'm, I'm closer to Dallas, Texas versus all of those. Yeah, me and you are about the same distance from here to Canada, though. So. Yeah. Um, Yeah, no, I can up it to six and see if that helps. Yeah, um, let's do that. It might just end up kicking me off the server for a little bit, though. Well, it's probably going to have to restart the server, so. Yeah. But yeah, like, once once I log back in, open a chest, and um, get um, X out of the chest, I just start waiting for server. Because, like... And on my stream, I'm doing perfectly fine. I'm not seeing any red or anything. I can I might have glitched out in the, in Discord for a minute, but that also might have been from my mic being a little far away from my mic, my face. So. Yeah, it just costs an extra twenty-two dollars to upgrade to six gigabytes. So. Which will probably be worth it in the end when we get higher mod packs. So. Okay. So I think you have to wait for it to go through, I think. Oh no, it says six. Is our server at six now though? Let's see. It says six gigabytes is active. Uh, you probably restart the server. Probably wouldn't hurt. Yeah. Are you still having problems? Yeah. Okay, let's get the server a restart and go from there. Uno momento, uh, followers, viewers. We apologize for um, the yep. technical the difficulties yep if this doesn't help i don't know what to tell you other than us upping it to a, a premium server and then paying the extra money to get um to a premium server and then we can put in dallas well how much is the premium server um let me double check um from is that premium to worth it in the end uh, uh but it's only see the difference between the premium and the because if this is okay. the server, so a lot, it might be worth it. So, so the budget, um, budget six gigs is seventeen forty nine seventeen ninety four a month. But I do it, I do it semi annually, so it's a, it saves mm -hmm. a little bit. Um, so semi annually, it's ninety four dollars every six months for six gigabytes budget. Um, 
That's actually not bad, to be honest. That's budget. The premium. <laughs> oh, that's budget. Okay. The bad. premium is an extra twelve dollars a month. So it's $157. So it's an extra $60 essentially for for six months. In the long in the wrong run, that's not bad, but in the short run, yeah. Yeah. If you do it yearly, it's 15% off, which is $305 for a year compared to budget, which is if you do so it's which like, is oh god oh wow mm-hmm. it's that's a it's 120 dollars difference if you do it annually from the budget to the premium 120 dollars difference actually it's in new jersey the several locations actually in new jersey hmm. but yeah it, it's just 120 dollars difference if you go yearly It has best for mod packs, six gigabytes, so on the budget one, so. We'll see what happens diff- here. So. The only difference is just the, the server location, Ableton. And the unlimited amount of slots for players, which makes no sense because if you're playing a mod pack, it's not unlimited. You need to up your RAM, it's not unlimited slots. Yeah. Well, it's like only two people play on these, uh, about two to four players play on it, so. Okay, it stopped so, and is starting now. Okay. So we're just sticking with the base version? Yep, we're just sticking with budget. I will tell you when it is done. Shoot myself. No, no, not really. Legally, I can't. I'm hating it. Hating life for me? No, sort of. I guess. Fair enough. I'm fucking depressed. Tis loading up. Tis loading up. Imagine if, imagine if you were playing destroy and open Pokemon cards, so you'd have to destroy a certain amount of packs and then open a certain amount of packs. But one of the uh, the destroy packs had a uh, a five thousand dollar Pokemon card. Yeah, Charizard. Yeah. yeah. No, I I, I yeah. saw that TikTok. I saw that TikTok. <laughs> Dude, fucking nuts. Dude. I, I was de- I was depressed watching that. But it's just, whew. yeah. Like shit. If I if I stayed doing Pokemon when I was younger, dude, I'd probably be fucking rich by now. Nah, who, just gamble, who just, ga- just gamble your money on Robit. Just gamble your money on Robit, dude. <laughs> Yeah, easier. I might end up doing it. I might just do like five dollars every time. Because I can, I can easily make a good, uh, good five, good twenty-five dollars, or I can make a good negative twenty-five dollars. Mm-hmm. 
Is that not? So if I go in the negatives, do I pay the do I pay the amount of money that I lost, or do you I don't just go in, you don't go in the you don't go in the negatives. You only bet how much you have. Okay. Duh. It's weird that it's not showing though. I'm still still loading up for me. Are you? Yep, it's still loading. I figure out why this image doesn't work. There we go. Back up. Yep. Let's find out if it still works. I got the Minecraft window. Oh, so I got a copyright claim on a video I put to YouTube because uh, it was a Paul Walker or Paul McCartney uh, song um, on uh, Tangled Shore, the Destiny, uh, the tank when you're walking into that, that lost sector. Damn. Yeah, that counts that as a copyright sucks. strike. That so I had to, I had, I had to mute. I had to mute that. that that 10 second clip from my YouTube video so I can get monetation, monetization back on it. So, yeah. That's, that fucking sucks, balls, dude. It's already 10 seconds, but still, like, it's like, come on, man. It's not my fault, Blim Bungie. <laughs> oh, your sword's chilling inside the uh, runic altar right now. Of course it is. I thought you were maybe standing there, but then I realized that it was just in the runic altar floating around. All right, we're waiting on server. We can open a chest. Can we open a chest again? Can we open a chest again? Can we open it again? And again, and again, and again. All right, we are being. Okay, anyways, we got the advanced alloy smelter up and going or the advanced alloy smelting factory. Um, I guess we can give it a, give it a look at how it actually works. Um, if we look here, go to here, um, we can make, what do we want to make? We can make the mirror ingots. Um, I can make dynite ingots and get double the amount. Yeah, double the amount. We need refined boosting mixture. Refined boosting mixture. Put in a fluid enricher. Or alchemical imbuer. Luxium. That's a found on the moon. Luxium or a vilum ingot. I might have to make a vilum ingot. Rorium and ardite. Oh, I made some vilum before. But we don't have, or do we have? A factory ingot, former fluid. Yeah, we have fluid infuser. Here we go, fluid infuser. So we can do it. Um, we need the uh, advanced, the uh, refined boosting mixture. So that so. did help. Uh, to be honest, it did help. Gotcha. Bow, bow, bow. Okay, so we aren't gonna make it. So it does double and triple in some cases this advanced alloy smelter, uh, but we need we do need refined, <gasps> refined boosting mixture, which is made with vitamin ingots and. Too soon, dude. Huh? I spoke too soon. I don't know what the fucking issue is, dude.
says waiting. Like you're not even there on my screen, but you're literally standing right in front of me, but you're not. I don't know. Oh, I heard a chest open. I, I literally see you moving, like. Yeah. I've never had these problems before, dude. Do you have dog arguments in your thing? I do not. Well, that's might be the reason why since you deleted your pack and you don't have the job arguments anymore. That might help you a little bit. Let's send them my way. The only other thing I can think of is remember we had that problem where the server kept um kept um what's the word I'm looking for? Um knocking you off or not knocking you off crashing or whatever. Um yeah. and I upped the the server tick thing. Um And that, that should be for all of us, though, not just um, yeah. just you, though. Attempting connection with missing mods. What? In my Minecraft log. Yeah, what's it? Look at your Minecraft log and see what it says. Uh, fifteen ten forty four, netty client io hashtag twenty slash info fml, attempting connection with missing mods, smooth, font core controlling crafting tweaks, c two gui ctm custom min, custom main menu default options. That's not, that sounds like server. That sounds like series or server wide mods that you don't use in your client. Yeah, I, after all that, it says um, re authentication at the server. So. Minecraft chunk cache 224. 224 still hanging around after 60 seconds. Hmm. 
when you ask the um, Discord server if they have anyone in this problem before, because I mean, it's their pack, so. Built block state lookup table in 1,005 1, milliseconds. Netty client info. Uh, clear the cache for astral sorcery. Disconnect from server. Unable to, unable to get any texture to use as a color for thermal dynamics. Yeah, I've got some red right here, some errors. Um, there's a bunch of nuclear craft shit that's in the red. As well as Draconic Evolution, Dungeon Tactics. Yeah, a bunch of nuclear craft and Draconic Evolution, Dungeon Tactics. It's showing all red. Flight goggles. Oh, I'll be right back. Mm -hmm. Hammer core custom data file not found. I think I'm just going to stop this stream and then we're going to start back up again after we get yours fixed, I think. Yeah. I mean, this is, this is an hour long stream, so it's fine. We'll just, I'll just keep it. But yeah, I'm just going to stop it for now. Okay, right, guys, we're going to stop it for now. Uh, I know some of the streams are coming back and forth, and we did we did do the thing, um, but we're perks having problems, so we're going to go ahead and fix that. I need to take a call real quick. So we're just going to stop the stream. We're going to start back up in a little bit with another title, and catch you guys all next time. So peace out. Look forward to the next one.